Finally, time to export has come. We've gotten an opportunity to start exporting from Kenya. I have been waiting for this moment. I have been researching and I have been waiting to, you know, to understand all this kind of stuff. Yeah. And I'm happy that we have come to this far. So I am actually looking for people who have products or things that we can actually, you know, export from Kenya. And uh, maybe we can get a chance to sell this product in China. Finally, I'm looking for you. If you are the one, I'm actually looking for you. Please take the number on my bio. Come to my inbox and then I'm going to give you the further details. So, hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Miss Karinge. If at all it is your very first time coming over here, please make sure that you like the video and hit that subscription button. So guys, over for the longest time, I think since the year 2021, I have been talking a lot about importing products from China. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. And I, through this journey, I know I have helped a very good number of people whom I know and others whom I do not know, whom I have seen their progress and i actually do appreciate and i thank god for every step of the way that we have worked together with you whatever is true or much that i've been able to help you i am so much happy and as i do this kind of content i have received critics others appreciate uh the one who appreciate mostly they are those people who would want to buy their products from china and then sell them in kenya Again, I have received critics to those people who feel that imports is one of the ways in which we are sabotaging the economy, which I also agree when I try to look at the economic perspective of it. We are importing so much than how, than how we are exporting. But then I myself as a common citizen, what can I do? What can I do? um we have seen people who have tried to go into manufacturing or production and you know the journey is never that easy it has a lot of challenges so generally i person as a common citizen there's nothing i can do or i can say maybe the government has a lot of work to do ensuring that it is actually encouraging local manufacturing yeah and stuff like that but anyway i myself i'm just an entrepreneur and as we learned about business studies, I remember we learned that an, who is an entrepreneur? An entrepreneur is just a person who identifies a business opportunity, you know, and, you know, tries to find ways and, um, you know, to fill that gap. So basically, that is me. That is me. Today, if I hear mask, they are selling so well. I would definitely go for it. I am an entrepreneur. I know it is COVID-19 or another disease. People are suffering from it. But at, at the end of the day, I am an, an entrepreneur. I identify that gap in the society and I try to find ways on which to fix it. Anyway, guys, uh, that being said, I being an entrepreneur, I, um, I have been researching about exporting, which I know it's not that easy. But then again, then again, um, an entrepreneur looked after two opportunities. So guys, this is what I, I, I actually have an opportunity. I don't want to talk much about it here in the video, but there is an opportunity. And what actually I'm looking for, I need somebody who has product. I don't know whatever they are. I don't know whether they are produce or products, whatever they are, but they are they are locally available or maybe they are produced here in kenya uh but then uh our target market or whereby we are going to export these products it will be in china so i don't want something looking like our china i don't know if anybody can understand me nataka kitu inaka kikenya kikenya hivi yeah and if I told you are from other African countries, something looking African, that is what I'm actually looking for. Unajua, I know there are people who are in production and maybe they import stuff from China which are half reprocessed and wanakuja, wanamalizia production here locally. I am not looking for that, I'm sorry. I'm looking kwa ile kitu inakam. African stuff, maybe. Kitu inaka ki Kenya, let me see. So that is what I'm, I'm actually looking for. So if I told you are into that field, you have a product or a produce, 
um and i would want you to understand that our clientele is based in china so uh, please there is you i am looking for there's a very good opportunity um I myself and others we are working towards something and uh, we would want to maybe start that business of exporting and we are looking for you so what are you going to do please take my number on my bio and then after you take that number i am going to give you details on how you are going to con to um the other details that we actually need and then we can see it the way forward and uh, so basically this video was all about that whether we import or re-export we are entrepreneurs and we need to make money yeah so guys as usual as much as this video is very short thank you so much guys for watching this video don't forget to subscribe as usual in our mandarin corner i want to teach you how to say you know to make a call make a call make a call we say that in hua da din hua so for example we can say uh if you are that kind of a company that i am looking for please contact me on my whatsapp and i'm going to give you a call so i am going to give you a call or i'll give you a call i, I can say wo gei ni da din hua wo gei ni da din hua wo is i gei is give uh ni is you that can mean to hit a call give you a call so i will give you a call so if you are that company or that person who has those products that i'm actually looking for please contact me and then later i'll give you a call so thank you so much guys for watching this video until next time bye bye and